morning, friends. You are balanced on my handle flask. But hi, welcome. Mom, this is such a <laughs> this is a good tripod. Good morning, good morning, friends. Welcome back to the vlog. I am about to get ready to go to lunch, actually. But um, my goal today is to finish this cardigan that I have been working on for the longest time ever. I just need to do the sleeves right now. It shouldn't be long, right? It shouldn't take long. But anyway, I want to finish this today um, after I get back from lunch because I want to wear it tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm going to go get lunch again. <sighs> Guys, lunches and lunches. Um, but yeah, that's my goal for today. Um, when I came back, when I come back from lunch, I have to start thinking about gifts too. Um, this morning, I went on TikTok and then I saw people make knit knitted and crochet ornaments. And guys, guys, I need to make it. I know for sure I'm gonna make the. Um, ornament version of the Visteria pillow for sure definitely that's happening that's already happening um, and I saw this like pretzel one that's like really cute I think and I have the yarn for it look at this isn't this the perfect yarn to knit or crochet I'll probably crochet it because knitting a tube feels so much harder than crocheting a tube but anyway this as a pretzel guys do you not do you see it but yeah that's what I spend my morning doing <laughs> looking at people knitting and crocheting ornaments but anyway I'm gonna go get ready for lunch now I am going to wear my cardigan it's finally cold here I mean 50 60 degrees Fahrenheit it's perfect cardigan weather so I'm gonna be wearing today I'm going to wear my cardigan out do you remember my firstborn my first child my hard patch cardigan so yeah I'm wearing her out today but I was doing my pajamas look at this pants I thrifted <laughs> but yeah that's the plan for this weekend. Finish this, and if if I finish this fast, if I have time, I think we're gonna start my champagne cardigan. I keep talking about it. I keep talking about champagne cardigan, but I never do anything about it, and I'm afraid that it's gonna get too cold to wear cardigans now. That I should start working on sweaters instead. But anyway, I will keep you guys updated. Like the moment it came out, so I'm like, like this. <laughs> <laughs> It is 
the next next day um obviously i didn't finish my cardigan because who am i <laughs> who am i to think that i can finish two sleeves in six hours but anyway this is how much i have just looking gorgeous and um i'm also on the last skein of yarn that are from the same dye lot um so this second sleeve will probably probably be uh the last sleeve will probably be a different dye lot but i think it should be fine because the color is like off white i don't think it's gonna be that much different i hope but yes this is the progress on the cardigan and also i am also almost done i am also almost done with my vest um, i'm almost done with the back panel so once i'm finished once i finish the back panel it's only just the ribbing left so i'm hoping i can get that done today as well i have a whole day today so i can knit and hold I have a whole day today so I can just sit and knit and crochet for the whole day so these are the two things these are the two things I'm gonna be working on today and I will keep you guys home I went to my parents house to spend time with them but I am home now I went over there to spend some time with them 
and yeah we just hang out in the backyard um it was nice we had a really nice weather today before the sun went down but um i am working on my sleepover i'm trying to finish this before i want to wear this on thanksgiving which is like two days away but i am doing the collar right now the v-neck ribbing part so i probably will finish this tonight and then do the ribbing for the other arm hole tomorrow but yes not much going on i also got some new yarn i'll show you like tomorrow morning i should have shown you i got it a few days ago but um i have just i have been busy i have been super busy so i couldn't really vlog i got some sock yarn because i want to start knitting socks for um christmas actually okay okay i'll show you and if the lighting is bad i'll show you again in the morning but these are the opal sock yarn i'm not even gonna try to pronounce the names i mean these two are the van gogh one the van gogh colors which is so pretty and then i got some of those so i'm gonna be knitting um chris i'm gonna be knitting socks for my family so we're gonna each get one pair of socks for christmas it's just so cute isn't that the cutest thing um i've never knitted socks before so that's gonna be fun but yeah i got this off i got this from an etsy shop guys look at this when you live with a man this is what <laughs> anyway um but yeah i got these off of an etsy shop i will link them down below um i think the price isn't too bad um these were like 15 16 dollars for each ball and then one ball can make a pair of socks so i don't know i think it's way cheaper in europe anyway but it wasn't too bad for me i got four of them and then the shipping was so fast so i'll link the shop that i got these from down below yeah i'm excited so i need to finish the best first so i can start working on these um i have not been working on anything else still haven't finished my cardigan i have a long weekend off from thanksgiving so i might have more time to knit and crochet but still gonna be spending time with friends and family but i'll keep you guys updated anyway wearing my slipover the comfiest um tiffany actually reposted um another version of this in red I need it. I need to make one in red. Is that I'm gonna get the exact same yarn that they use for the sleepover. So I'm really in a shopping mood right now, so I might get I might be buying a lot of yarn over the next few days. But yeah. I'll catch you guys later. I'm gonna go finish my vest. The ribbing for my vest now. yet because i have to go i have to go i just like bind it off the second arm this morning i'm gonna quickly say happy thanksgiving um grateful for all of you grateful that i have this space to talk about my silly little hobbies but anyway 
I gotta go right now. Um, happy Thanksgiving. Grateful for you. Be safe. Um, I'll just see you later. days later after Thanksgiving I just want to quickly show you I just want to quickly sit down and talk about my vest that I wore on Thanksgiving and I finished but I have not yet I have yet to weave in the ends I haven't blocked it yet I just wore it like I finished it on the day on Thanksgiving and then I just bind off and wore it to lunch and dinner. But this is what she looks like. This is Drops Nepal. I use nine and a little bit skeins in total. And this is what it looks like. I really like how like comfy it is. Like it's so comfy. And it's like oversized. Um, I'll put I'll write down all the details and modifications that I did. I did quite a bit of modifications. Um, I'll put it on my Ravelry, so if you guys are interested, you can go and read it. But yeah, it's a lot drippier than I thought it would be. I think it's because of the yarn, because of the alpaca in this yarn. But yeah, the arms are super huge. And yeah. Really happy with how this turned out. Gonna be wearing this a lot. And it's quite warm as well. Um, I haven't worn it directly on my skin, so I don't know if it's scratchy or not, but it's been nice so far. But yeah, I may have picked up um, two few stitches here, so it's kind of like bunching up a little bit in the wee neck. But overall, I really like this. It's giving dark academia if you guys saw the reference picture um this is pretty close to what i wanted in the first place so i'm really happy about it one thing that i did um i actually like the the center stitch here turned out really wonky so i went in with crochet and fix it to make it more straight um <coughs> I just did slip stitch all the way through here to make it neat but other than that I just followed a pattern but anyway I've just been spending time with friends and family this weekend so I haven't got time to knit or crochet or do anything else related to that but I think I might cast on one of the socks today 
Um, I don't know which color I want to do first. One of these is going to be for my sister and my mom. So like these two are going to be for um, my mom and my sister. But I don't know which one I want to do first. I'm going to be using, I'm thinking if I should go with just vanilla sock pattern. Sorry, my neighbor. I'm thinking if I want to go for just like a plain vanilla sock pattern or I want to do I found this pattern when I was looking at this color on Ravelry on Ravelry I can never say it when I was looking at this color on Ravelry I saw one person use this sock pattern and it looks really pretty it's called the Cobru Cobru socks I'm not sure I'll put a picture up somewhere but yeah, it looks really pretty with this yarn, and I might use that. I'll have to decide. But I'm gonna go with, I am going to use Magic Loop for right now because I don't want to commit to like a socks circular needle yet because I don't know if I'm gonna enjoy knitting socks or not. So I will go with Magic Loop first and see how it goes. If it's too much frustration, then I might find like a cheap circular sock needle to make these four pair of socks. But yeah, as always, keep guys updated. Good morning, guys. I'm wearing a store bought knit, which feels like a crime, but I bought this way before I started knitting, okay? So. I'm going to quickly show you. So I'm going to show you the sock that I started last night. Ooh. I started this sock last night. Guys, it's so cute. Look at the colors. I mean, knitting with self-striping or like variegated yarn is always so fun. But this is my progress. Um... I'm using the Cobru sock pattern. Um, I'll link it down below. But um, it was on sale too because of Black Friday holiday thingy. But um, this is on 2.25 millimeter, and I am using Magic Loop, which is not too bad. It is not too bad because I have learned how to do it correctly. So yeah, it's been fun. I am about to head out and go to a coffee shop and get some knitting done maybe go to a bookstore I've been wanting to buy um, new books even though my TBR is piling up but <laughs> I want to go look at some new books because they have a sale anyway um, also if you guys follow me on Instagram you might see me I got a back row guys Look how cute! I'm thinking I should like crochet a ribbon and then like hang it on the side. I don't know, but this is she. Um, I am gonna put my knit in here and go to a cute little coffee shop and knit and go to a bookstore. Guys, guys, this is going to fit my opal sock yarn. I have to reorganize this. But anyway, I'll catch you guys later.